for the mermaid blog modules to function at all, we need some blog posts, we need some categories assigned, and we need some featured images. Otherwise, you would import the modules, but there'd be no posts to be assigned. So uh, hopefully you already have those on your site. If you don't, we've provided some sample posts and some featured images, which you can then import uh, and use. So we're going to show you how to do that. First of all, let's go and import the blog posts. Uh, for that, you would go to your site and then go to tools and hit the import section and then run the WordPress importer. Then we have to navigate to the XML file, which you'll find under downloads in your folders. So let's look for a sample blog post mermaid bundle. Let's click on that. And then let's click upload and import. And then don't worry about download uh, and import file attachments. This won't work uh, for you. It has to be connected to the same user. So just ignore that one. Then you wanna assign it to an existing user. I'm just going to assign it to myself, then let's click submit, there we go, all imported. So now if we go to posts, we'll see our sample blog posts. But the next thing we have to do is we have to go and assign some custom uh, featured images. First, you'll notice there are categories assigned. This is important to have the categories in order for them to show on the pages where you are in using the blog modules. Next, we'll want to import those featured images. So I'm going to go to media, uh, media library, add new, and then we're going to navigate to those image file. So we just click select, and then I'll go to featured images. Uh, these will be again in your downloads folder. You can just unzip them and open it. And then we're going to add those featured images. Let me click on that. That's quite zippy. Okay, and then we're done. So the next thing we want to do is go to posts. So we want to assign those featured images. I'm just going to assign one and then I'll uh, do the rest quickly so that we can have good samples with that. So set featured image and then you just want to grab this one over here. Those are the ones we've just uploaded um, and you'll see featured image number four. Uh, there we go. And you just click set featured image and then you can update the post. I'm gonna pause and do the rest of those. Okay, so that's all done. Just to confirm, we've got all our posts, we've got categories assigned, uh, we've got featured images for all of those which are required for best results, and now we can go to the next video. Thanks for watching.